have some really cold temperatures coming our way this New Year's Eve, and when it gets cold, everything starts to freeze. That's right, and KSNT <laughs> News reporter Katie Garceron joining us live from downtown Topeka. Katie, what's the scoop? Yes, Brooke McKenzie, I got to speak with a plumber who works for Blue Dot here in town today, and he gave me some great advice on ways, on things that you can do in your home to make sure that your pipes do not freeze this upcoming weekend. One of those pieces of advice being as simple as just making sure the cabinet underneath your sink is open so that warm air can get through to it. Now, Nick McCart is the supervising plumber for Blue Dot. He says that Blue Dot fixes around 30 to 40 frozen pipes a year, and there are many different things people can do to ensure their pipes don't freeze. The number one thing is to make sure that your hose is disconnected outside. He says that if this doesn't happen, it can cause detrimental damage. I can't stress enough the hoses outside being connected to your hose bibs. Those are the ones that break now, and then we come out to clean your air conditioner, and they turn the hose on, and it floods the basement. So you really got to make sure those are taken care of. If there are cold spots in your house, turn your furnace up slightly and make sure doors are open and use a fan so that the air can flow through your house. Now, please dress in warm layers this weekend and try and stay as cozy as possible as that cold winter weather hits us. In downtown Topeka, covering local news that matters, I'm Katie Garceron, KSNT News. All right, thank you, Katie.